Hi, my name is Ken. And I'm Ariana. And today is Wednesday, October 16, 2024. Here are this week's updates from Highlander, Highlander Highlights. Highlights. Updates from Counseling. Enrollment for quarter two driver's education is October 16th at 5 p.m. Please check your email for the link to sign up. This course is offered by the district to all Fresno Unified School District high school students. If you're interested, set an alarm at 4.55 p.m. and sign up for a session that you can attend. Latin Expo is coming to Fresno on November 1st. Don't miss out on this incredible opportunity to connect with over 35 universities and technical schools in one place. Seats are limited. Pick up a permission slip from counseling office by Monday, October 21st. Seniors, if you are interested in continuing with the UC application, please work on your personal insight questions. Counselors will have a second workshop to review your academic history in depth this week. Thank you for attending our first CSU College application workshop last week. Seniors, remember to work on your EOP questions for the application. You want to make sure you complete it before December 2nd. Our next workshop will be on October 29th and 30th. The last day to submit your CSU application is on December 2nd. Please contact your counselor and do not submit your application without a counselor review. Now, we have a message from Link Crew. Link Crew would like to remind you to tackle stress like a champion. Now that we have finished quarter one, Link Crew wants to remind everyone to be like water boy and take care of yourself. Drink plenty of water, eat well-balanced meals, surround yourself with positive and supportive people, and don't forget to set goals. Make the goals small enough that you can accomplish them and create another to challenge yourself. Check out Link Crew's bulletin board at the corner of the quad in the display case near the a &S building. Our first feature story this week comes to us from Leo and Ken, and it's all about the girls' volleyball team. Hey guys, it's Ken with Highlander Highlights. Today we're here at the McLean Gym for the McLean girls' volleyball game against Matilda Toros. And we're gonna go interview some people, so let's go. So now I'm here with Camila, Christine. Okay, Camila and Christine. Um, so what do you guys think you guys can improve on on your next game? Um, Loki, just having a better mindset, and communicating more. For sure, I would agree with mentality and just everyone being hyped. For sure, for sure. You know, I hope you guys do you know better your next game and you know get that win and you know just keep a good more for you guys and your team. You know, good luck on the next game. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you for the interview. You're welcome. <laughs> you're, you're welcome. That's it for tonight. Thank you for watching Highlander Highlights. If we reach 900 subscribers before, before the end of the year, we'll drop our adventure song. If we hit 1,000 subscribers at the end of the year, we'll drop our adventure mixtape. I'm Ken Jong from Highlander Highlights. Have a good night, everyone. Thanks, guys. Great job. Now, we have a feature story about the Battle of Cedar that took place at Sunnyside high school last Thursday, brought to you by Leo, Ken, and Tatiana. Hi, I'm Tatiana Powell, here with Highlander Highlights, and today we were at the Ballot Cedar Pinko game at the Sunnyside Stadium, and we're here to interview some people, so let's go. So today I'm here with? This is your new house, class of 2025, athlete at McLean. So how does winning the Battle of Cedar game this year make you feel? It feel good being the leader of this team, um, being a leader, staying mentally focused, staying in the game. Everybody know I usually pop off and get out the game and that, that always starts something, but today I was focused, leading the team and just letting everything come to me and not forcing nothing and see the outcomes. Felt great. So how does winning in an environment like this make you feel? It was good, um, lifting my teammates up, um, everybody staying hungry, focused for our po purposes, and knowing what we want to do because this was low-key last game to, uh, of the season. We cake now. All right, thank you for the interview. Thank you. 
So this is our Battle of Cedar game this year at Sunnyside High School. Thank you for watching and back to the studio. Finally, we have a slideshow from the Quinceanera fashion show that took place last Friday. Sports updates. This Thursday, our girls' tennis team has their senior night as they take on Hoover High School at Hoover. Matches start at 3 p.m. So make sure you go out and support your girls' tennis team. That's all for this week. Thanks for watching, and tune in next week for more updates from Highlander, Highlander Highlights. Highlights.